Hi folks, I'm glad you're all here. Boy, what a busy day. Think God's trying to tell us something. There was a magnitude 4.7 earthquake there in Bosnia, Herzegovina. Um, yeah, it's just rocking in and rolling around the world. This earthquake was felt by a lot of people. 1,699 people sent in felt reports to EMSC. 33 reports to USGS and they gave it an intensity level of 6. It was a thrust earthquake. Let me show you. Yeah, the first wave of the earthquake came from the south. Tension was applied basically going up. Uh, looks like the fault moved going um, towards the east. Yep, a thrust earthquake. One of the felt reports sent into EMSC said it was a very long earthquake. Um, extreme. Let's see. A lot of these I'm going to have to translate. Looked like a strong earthquake to me. Everything was shaking. It started cracking, screeching. Tenants in Zeneca came out in front of the buildings car alarms went off so they were evacuating so going to google earth i want to go to that location um that would be down south okay quite a ways um down over there that's where they're evacuating buildings very strong but stable not too long we already had no earthquakes for several months i do have another one posted for this area let's see where is it at all right, let me bring it out. Where do I have it? Oh, down over here. Okay, a 4.5 Bosnia. Um, that was October 2nd. Same location for Zeneca. Very long and strong. Everything shaking quite a lot for 20 seconds. Let's see. The walls were swaying. People came out in front of buildings. It took a long time. I'm hoping to find some videos here on Twitter. These are all the felt reports sent into EMSC. Supposedly about 3 million people felt this earthquake. Intensity level 6 means it was felt by all. Many were frightened and ran outdoors. I wonder if there's power outages. Does anyone know? Falling plaster and chimneys damage would be small. Looks like it was felt as far as Budapest. Let's see, probably down there in Montenegro. Yeah, here we have the Adriatic Sea. In 1963 in Skopje, I'm sorry for pronouncing that wrong, former Yugoslavia, um, there was a 6.1 earthquake. Over 13,000 people were killed during that earthquake. And over 200,000 became homeless. Let me bring this back out to today's earthquake, which would be up over here towards the uh, the top. For the Balklands in this area, um, earthquakes, large earthquakes are relatively very rare. In 1979, also there in Montenegro, um, there was a 6.9. Luckily, yeah, I can't say it's really lucky. Um, 128 people were killed. And over a thousand people were injured in that earthquake. They didn't really have rules about earthquake standards and seismicity until 1981. So hopefully buildings that were made, built after that, yeah, they have better earthquake standards. Yeah, I wish I could give you more information about the fault lines and things like that, but I do not have that for this location all dotted out it's just been so darn busy today i got an earthquake for south carolina that i got ready and trying to put together and these earthquakes around the world just keep coming and coming yeah evacuations and damage um yeah sending prayers to you guys if you live in some of these older homes you, yeah you most definitely got damage and more than likely injuries i hope i pray there is no death if you have more information, please put your um, that down below. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. As always, please stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.